And so we're proud that we are put together um, a venture called uh, the Texas Thoroughbred Racing Club. And we're going to go to the two-year-old in training sale at Lone Star Park on April 6th. And we're going to look, look to buy um, a two-year-old. And Danny, you know, just give him a feel for what you're going to kind of look for. Uh, and let me explain one other thing. On April 4th, two days before the auction, there's going to be a breeze show where the horses actually work out in the morning and you can watch them breeze. So, Danny, what's, what are you going to be looking for there? Well, uh, I'll be watching the workouts uh, closely and watching them live. And, and then I'll, you know, you're always going to go back and look at the videos, but just uh, watching the horses work out and their body language and... Uh, you know, just the, the, their body position, uh, the efficiency of their stride, and uh, how they how well they seem to enjoy it and keep going after the workout, after the time work workout, and and then of course uh, once that's all done, and, and and I pick out several that I like, they were in motion. Well, then I'll go and examine the individual uh, at the barn where the consigners have them for sale. And just see what I think of his confirmation, and uh, and actually that's one sale that I don't study the book that much prior to a uh, yearling sale. I'll study the book pretty extensively prior to, uh, but the the two-year-old and training sale I like to see them in motion uh, because that can give me a large indication of an athlete, uh, and also a large indication of how much they like their job, how efficient they are, and what they do, not just the speed they go in, but what I perceive to be efficiency or lack of is going to put me on some and, and off others. And, and Danny, if, if I could, when he talked about the book, there's a catalog, and so every horse that's for sale has its bloodlines in here. And they, there's a pedigree page that shows its sire, and then it's, you know, first three dams. And I brought this book out, and I just have one, but I'll leave it over on the counter. Anybody's, you know, can pick it up and look through it. And, and so that's one opportunity that you have to get involved in racehorse ownership. There are other opportunities. And um, for example, uh, anybody ever wanted to contact Danny and say, look Danny, I'd like to buy a horse privately or I'd like to claim a horse, because some races are claiming races where if you put up the money ahead of time, anywhere from five to 25,000, you could pick a horse and of course you would you know, have to have a trainer like Danny, and then at the end of the race, you own that horse. And a lot of people like to do it that way. There's a little more risk uh, because it's, you know, you've got just one horse, but uh, anybody that wants to get in the game to buy a horse either by claim or privately, we're glad to give you Danny's phone number and, uh, and you know, facilitate that. And we, we talked a little bit about different ways to get in the game, you know, private purchases, claiming, and as you know, Austin, because you're going to be part of it, we're doing the Texas Thoroughbred Racing Club. And there's an auction, as I've said earlier, April 6th at Lone Star Park, and Austin will train one or more of our horses. So Austin, you know, there is a breeze show two days before. What will you kind of look for at that sale? You know, uh, fluid movement, um, horses who who have like, you know, a straight straight running path. You know, uh, mind is just as important as ability. Um, I like to see horses who uh, gallop out strong after their work. Um, a, a ton, it's an extremely long list, and I wish that I that I could, th th knew it right here right now, but. After doing it, you know, my entire life, my dad was a trainer. Um, it's hard to explain other than when you see the horse do it, everybody here I can say, look, that horse right there is something special. You know, so, and, and, and the young horses, uh, you said something about claiming or sales, you know, the young horses are the most fun because you have, they could be anything, you know. 